Um, last year at a show, I wasn't even I wasn't even thinking seriously about what I was doing. I was actually having a conversation with my friend, and I said, "Okay, I'll, you know, I'll finish talking to you later." And we went in the ring, and all of a sudden, he and I were so in sync and so together. It was the most amazing run and as we kept doing each exercise I was like you know in my head I'm going he's doing really good he's doing really good uh, he did his last article and everyone started clapping and cheering and um, you know so we we're like yeah that's, you know that's cool so we get out of the ring and they start calling for runoffs and I'm like oh we're not even in a runoff darn you know and my mentor says, no, that's because you won outright. And sure enough, they called my number and I just, I mean, I started bawling. It was my first win. It was, it was the greatest experience ever. And he's my other half. He really is. Everyone where we train knows me as Emily and Tyler. You know, it's, it's one word. You know, he is, he's more closely in tune with me than any other dog I've ever owned. Um, he's just, he's my first obedience dog and he's, Amazing for for a dog that a is an off-breed and b a dog that I mean I didn't really know a lot about this. All I wanted to do was be able to do articles. To have a dog that's bonded so well with me and you know wants to do wants to do this, it's amazing. You know I really do feel like we're a team whenever we go out there. What starts off as a lot of work becomes fun. Don't get hung up on the scores. Don't get hung up on the numbers. There's nothing better than the bond that you end up having with your dog.